This is the 12th floor, 17th floor. It is the amenities deck where we have the, the pool and the amenities on top. And then the 18th floor is the roof deck. So we're on 12, it'll be six more. The third floor up to the 16th floor are all typical floors. They're all the same thing. And critical being able to keep stay on schedule is like when we pour a slab three days later, we get our concrete breaks on it. And that's, we get the concrete breaks from building earth. We're able to pull the cables, get the report, get it to the engineers, hopefully have it, have it approved that day. And if that happens, then we're able to pick up time on the schedule. Yeah, Emmanuel, he's one of the key guys doing our testing out here with the, with the dirt, the backfill, make sure everything's in compaction. Uh, he's on just about every uh, concrete test that we do out here. He does all the cylinders. Uh, like I said, if he does uh, one cylinder, he's done 5,000 cylinders out here. But he stays in touch with us, lets us know the slump, air content, make sure it's the right concrete and uh, the right mix before we put it in place. It's been uh, a real asset to have them on the job with our post tensioning, our subsurface, our concrete testing. Uh, everything that they do is top notch and number one. And uh, I, would, I would definitely love to have them on any project that I do. So part of our special inspections requirement on, on the Vesta project here is to verify that the uh, reinforcing steel is placed according to plan. So you can see here, uh, we have steel going both ways. Also part of that is verifying that the post tension cables are placed as the structural engineer designed. So here again, you see them going, going both ways. They'll bed head against the edge of the slab after it's poured, and after the concrete reach, reaches strength, then they'll come back and tension the cables. So that's what uh, Greg was talking about, uh, to get an early break sometimes uh, so they can know when the concrete reaches sufficient strength to go ahead and, and tension the cables.